and go ahead. Okay, we're going to do the uh, restroom process. Uh, first thing we're going to do is to take our red bucket and we're going to do, we're going to fill it with about two gallons of hot water instead of three for the floor. You see a mark down here for two. And we're going to take our green stuff again. And we're going to do. Put something in here. <laughs> See how things go. <laughs> we're going to do two ounces of green stuff. In the front of the bucket. And that, now we're ready to mop. We also have a bowl cleaner, restroom cleaner, which has some acid in it for the bowls. We have a disinfectant. This disinfectant is in a green cartridge. Come in these boxes. And you're going to fill the bottle with water. Insert the cartridge, and when you put the top in and close it, it's mixed. So there's no mixing for that. So you got your disinfectant for all your touch surfaces in the bathroom, you got your restroom cleaner for in the commode, and you've got a bowl swab or a bowl brush for cleaning the bowls with. We use the red mop for the bathroom. Always watch these top pieces here so you don't end up knocking off a, a light. And we also use the orange claws. The orange and the red signify uh, a little more danger, so uh, there's, there's more potential bacteria in these places. So the key to cleaning the bathrooms is a frequency, so we keep them clean on a regular basis. We'll go into a bathroom now and set up to, to do the cleaning.